Hello. In this lecture, we will discuss about the projection of a straight line. As we have discussed the earlier projection of point and uh, shown all the points in all the quadrants and their projections. Now we will discuss about the straight line and their projections in various conditions. And there are mainly six conditions uh, in straight line. Uh, first is perpendicular to HP and parallel to BP Perpendicular to BP and parallel to HP Parallel to both HP and BP Inclined to HP and parallel to BP Inclined to BP and parallel to HP And uh, there is one more condition that is line contained by one or both the planes Means line is lying on one plane Means on HP or in the BP Now I will show you all the conditions practically. Firstly, perpendicular to HP and parallel to BP means this is HP and this is BP. Perpendicular to HP and parallel to BP. Now second condition, perpendicular to beach BP and parallel to HP like this. It is perpendicular to BP and parallel to HP. Now parallel to both HP as well as the BP means it is parallel to this and this BP and now fourth condition inclined to HP and parallel to BP like this inclined to HP this is the HP inclined to this and parallel to BP now next inclined to BP and parallel to HP like this inclined to BP and parallel to HP and now line contained by one or both the planes means line lying on HP or lying on BP now I will show you the projections of all these in a sheet of paper. In drawing the projections of a straight line, a uh, word matters that is true length. Means in which view, front view or top view, we are seeing the full length of that object. Like we have taken an example of a scale or a pen. Uh, means for first case, uh, when the line is perpendicular to HP and parallel to BP perpendicular to HP and parallel to BP means we are seeing the true shape in the front view so we will firstly draw the front view in this view uh, we are seeing the true length in the front view so we have drawn first the front view and then the top view when we see that uh, line from top we will see the A point first so we have written A comma B Now next condition perpendicular to BP and parallel to HP in this we will see the true shape in the top view so we will draw the top view first in this we have drawn the top view firstly as we are seeing the true shape and the front view in the next uh, upper part and uh, please note that uh, we have written here B dash firstly and then A dash because when we are seeing from the front we see the second point of the line which is uh, at far distance from the BP so we have written B dash and then A dash now next condition parallel to both HP and BP when it is parallel to both we will see the true shape in the front view as well as in the top view so we can make any view firstly means top view can be drawn firstly or the front view so we will draw here first view in first uh, like this These are the top views and these are the front views. We will draw the projectors. We are seeing uh, both in both cases the true shape means in front view as well as in top view. Now in next condition inclined to HP and parallel to BP 
and in this we will see the true shape in the front view so we will draw the front view firstly and then the top view this is the front view a dash b dash and now we will draw the top view by drawing the projectors of this line this is the marked examples and we will show other examples in the next lecture now we will join these projectors and making this as a point a and b this is the top view this is the front view and now in this case inclined to bp and parallel to hp we will see the true shape in the top view means it is inclined to vp that's why true shape will show the true length that's why we will draw the top view firstly it is inclined at some angle to the bp that's why we have drawn it inclined and now we will draw the projectors and show the front view these are the projectors drawn and this is a dash b dash the front view like this and the top view is this a b which is at angle theta to the vp another condition line contained by one or both the planes in this three condition lines means line lying on hp line lying on bp and line lying on the reference line when the line lying on the hp so we will draw the front view its front view will lie on the reference line when the line is lying on hp so this is the front view a dash b dash and its top view will be uh, at some distance from the BP like this so this is the top view AB and when line lying on the BP VP may jab lie karega then we will see in the front view uh, and the top view both uh, will show the true shape so we will draw the top view firstly so it will lie on the reference line means a b and on drawing the projectors we will show the front view a dash b dash and when land lying on the reference line so it will be drawn on the uh, reference line itself like this it means it is like this it means both the uh, lines means front view and the top view lies in the reference line a dash a and b dash b now i will show one typical example means condition in the next video which is line inclined to both hp and bp and uh, some examples were also shown to you to elaborate the straight line thank you keep subscribing for 20k views for more videos